A costly turnover on the first day of the Super Bowl experience. Somebody ran off with $100,000 worth of property from a third-party vendor. It happened last night at about 5 o'clock at the Phoenix Convention Center downtown. And police are still searching for the crooks tonight. Fox 10's Marissa Sarbeck is live with the latest. Marissa. Yeah, Brian, Linda, this is $100,000 in production gear, according to Phoenix PD. So the NFL says it was stolen from a vendor's vehicle just outside the Phoenix Convention. Center. Well, Valley residents we spoke with say this isn't the message that we want to be sending to people visiting Arizona for Super Bowl week. It's crazy. It's but that's today's world, right? Those visiting and those that live here learning $100,000 worth of production gear was stolen from a vendor at the Super Bowl experience this weekend. It's, it's definitely weird coming home and just seeing how much crime has happened, you know, from being gone 25 years ago. Um, it's a different valley, but, you know, I hope we as a community can make it better. Police confirmed the theft was on Washington Street, right near the Phoenix Convention Center. These roads have been closed during the Super Bowl experience, meaning foot traffic is the primary way to get around. And with heavy surveillance around the event, Phoenix police will likely have quite a bit of footage to search through to find those responsible. But the majority of people are simply out enjoying what is meant to be the start of all the fun the Valley has to offer this week. It's crazy, like all the streets closed and everything is crazy. All these people are just, it's, it's kind of awesome though, seeing everyone in their jerseys and everything. So I think it's kind of cool. The crowds at the convention center are overwhelming for some. I thought it'd be better organized. I've been to All-Star experience, NCAA experience, and it's never been the lines like this. But many locals excited to see how Arizona has grown over the last two decades. It's amazing. We've been gone for 26 years. My husband's retired military, so this is our first year back. So to come home to this is super cool. Phoenix police and the NFL have not yet identified the vendor that experienced theft. Brian, Linda.